Hi guys, so for the first time in Assetto Corsa they've actually added a Mercedes-Benz car. Uh, you can see I'm just setting myself up for a race. It's the Mercedes-Benz SLS AMG. I've got all the settings on Pro, uh, so it's going to be quite interesting. Let me tell you, this car took me about two hours to learn to drive before I was good with it. And now I'm going to go and race it. This should be good. We're all on identical cars. 98% opponent strength. I'm in fifth. Let's go. Oh, I've got a good start. I've got a good start. That dude, I can fit through there. No problem. I'm not sure whether to go down the inside or not. No, I'll just, I'll just take it easy. That's better. The thing is I've noticed about this car is it's deceivingly quick. I can nip down there. Oh my god. Can I hold it? Can I hold it? Can I hold it? There's a massive... Well, nearly lost it. There's a massive runoff on the left there. You can see, you can feel the rear wheel power. It's like 540 brake or something, this thing. And if you put your foot down, even slightly on an angle, that back end will step out, no problem. Brake. Off the brake. Down to third. Smoothness is the key. Two hours of practice. When I started driving this, I was coming off the track left, right and centre. Now, for some reason, I'm not as quick around here as they are. As you'll see, if I can just hold them off, that's good, that's good. Flat out round here. Fourth gear, down to second. Nicely done. I'm holding them off. I'm in first position. I didn't expect to be here at this point. This is the bend I don't like. I don't like this bend. I just can't seem to get... Look at him, he's down the inside of me already and I'm flat out. I don't know what they do better than me around that bend. Oh, I'm going to get... I'm so going to get pitted! Get off me, pal! Get off me! I need to get away from here. Third gear, hold on the inside line. If you go outside a little bit, they come on the inside of you. Right, floor it, floor it, floor it, let's go. But yeah, this car, I think the thing is about this car. What's that guy doing? He's having a look. I can go mostly flat out there, slow down a touch, and then... Oh, I thought it was gone! Oh my god. Um, yeah, I've noticed about this car is it's super powerful, but the engine seems to... It sounds low, it doesn't sound like it's really thrashing, so you, the power's deceiving. It's putting so much torque down, but you don't feel it. It's a very, very interesting car, though. Real challenge to master. I just hope I can hold first position. Paddle shift is... You can probably hear me paddle shifting. That's the... Um, the paddles. Maybe if I went manual, I'd probably get a bit more speed. But the car is designed to uh, be a paddle shift racer, so I thought I'd just go with that. I could probably get a bit more speed through there, I reckon, but I'm not going to complain. What I need to do is get up a buffer so that when I get to this bend round here, I've not got them looking up the inside of me. Ooh. Which freaks me out because... I have no confidence through this bend. I actually did that really well, actually. I'm too slow through there. I'm so slow, but... Honestly... Through that chicane, if you just even put the power on just slightly early, you're done for. I'm also trying to block them a bit, to be honest. Straighten up. Off we go. Flat, flat out. I mean, just look at the speed we're doing. Like, 130. No time at all. 154.4 best lap. Can I beat it? I am so much quicker through here than they are. This is where I get my time. I'll tell you what, I'd like to try one of these in real life. It's such a nice car. Yep, 
you can actually hear the brakes. Do you hear that whining? That's like the when you put the brakes really, really heavy, you can hear the brakes. Oh, careful. Now I've got a good lead. I just need to keep it. Final lap. Steady. Stay on target. That was sloppy. I came out of there a bit rough. I really don't want to lose this race. He's gonna try. He's trying to get down the inside. Get away from me! This is the bend. He's gonna do it. I'm so not gonna win this. He's. If I can keep the inside. Get away! Get away! Get off! Get off! No! No! My house. You're not nipping this from me. the pressure I can feel the pressure that guy all over the back I should be alright now I can hold the inside and he can't really do anything about it he's certainly pushing it oh yeah squirrel number one numero uno takes the checkered flag tell you what that guy was all over me that whole race oh that feels good what did I get Three, was that 351 total? Nine seconds to 10th place. Let's have a quick look at the replay. I'm really interested to find out what my line looks like because what I can't work out is why I'm, I'm so much quicker on that first right hand U bend. But on that chicane, they're so much quicker than me. I'm thinking they've got a different line. Damn, these cars look good. Look how low and squat they are. I tell you what, I can't wait till I can give you this video in 60 FPS. Because I'm recording right now in 60 FPS, but when I render it's 30. As soon as YouTube roll this out, you'll get this in 60. It's utterly gorgeous. So I've actually got a pretty good line through there. Those guys go wider than me, but... I don't know, I don't see any, I don't really see much need to go wide on that bend. There's no extra speed to be gained. That's a good line, that's a good line. I like that. Yeah. If you see yourself doing the same as the AI, you know you've got a decent racing line, that's what I say. Where are we? Not at the bend yet, are we? Let's see if I can get a different view. Play with the cameras. Ooh, that's a nice view. That's pretty cool. Look at this. I know you can actually drive like this, but I don't like driving like this. Right, this is the bend. This is where I get it horribly slow. I'm too far left, aren't I? Look at that. That's where I'm losing speed. Look at he's just on the inside of me there. Look at this. Oh my god, I'm amazed. <gasps> Look, the tail. I didn't notice the uh, the fin comes up when under braking. That's awesome. Oh my god, that guy. He wanted that so badly. Yeah, I think I need to go wider and then cut in. That's what I'm doing wrong. I think here I should have had more power down now. You can actually come out of there quicker than I did. Hundred and thirty miles an hour. Foom. <laughs> that bit though, if you don't ease off, you end up in the gravel. You just need to ease off a little bit. But here, I just completely and utterly dominate them around this bend. So they go almost as wide as I do, but for some reason, I carry more speed. Okay, this guy is just chasing me all the way around here. This is hilarious. Quite different, decent lead on him there, actually. That, now look at that. That was wide. That was definitely wide. They were they were inside, and I was I shot out wide on that one. So I had a bad line. I think watching yourself back like this, because when you're in the car in the cockpit, 
you think you're doing one thing and when it's only when you see yourself on camera that you realize that's not what you're doing like here's a classic example I think I'm all the way over to the right and then I cut in but on that one I did it better on the first lap it was awful He's cut, they cut over the rumble strip. They, yeah, they definitely cut that chicane better than me. So that's something to learn from this. Final bend, though. I think I've pretty much got that as much as you can get it. Well, that's... I mean, that's quite interesting to watch, actually. Um, anyway, I think... Uh, <laughs> I think we'll stop it there. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you enjoy my Seto Corsa. Again, leave a comment if there's any particular car or that you'd like to see me race in or particular um, uh, particular challenge that you'd like me to do. Um, I might try some mods. I think you get modded cars for this now, so I might try some mods. So if you've got any suggestions, please leave me a comment and uh, I'll take a look at it. But other than that, I just want to say, don't forget to click like and uh, take care, guys. Happy driving.